All right, so this problem asks you to use a tree diagram to illustrate all the possible outcomes for a couple having four children, assuming that the probability of having a boy equals the probability of having a girl. Um, so I want you to kind of list out all the, all the possibilities and then find the probabil probability that they'll have either all four boys or all four girls. So a tree diagram, something like this, Let's think about for their first child, what are the options? They could have either a boy or a girl. That's for their first kid. Um, and then the, for the next kid, it's the same options, but um, you draw little branches. So if, imagine they had the first boy, then their next option for their second kid are either a boy or a girl. Same thing if they had a girl, then their next option for their second kid is either a boy or a girl. And then for the third kid, now you see it's branching even more. If they had two boys, then they could either have another boy or they could have a girl. It's just like this. This is what the tree diagram looks like. B, G, B, G. Um, and then again, so this represents their first child right here. Second child, the different options. Third child, different options. Now a fourth child, different options. They could either have a boy or a girl. Same thing, just getting a little tedious here, but this is what it's looking like. Oops, I should write it in the same order. Just bear with me for a second. Boy, girl, boy, girl, boy, girl. Okay, so now basically, the options, the total number of possibilities there would be are represented by this bottom row because this option here means you've had boy, 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 boy. So this option here means they had boy, 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 girl. Now this option down here means they had boy, boy, girl, boy, and so on. Um, so that means there's a the total number of possibilities for the possible outcomes for a couple having four children, um, you know, if if order matters, if having a boy, boy, girl, boy is different from having a boy, 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 girl, then the total number of possibilities are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So um, what they're interested in is having all four boys. There's only one place where we had all four boys that was here. There's only one place where we had all four girls on our diagram, that's this last option here. And then of course, probability is equal to like the desired outcome over the total possibilities. In this case, we've got two, um, two of our desired outcomes, which is all boys or all girls, the ones I circled here. So there's two, and the total number of possibilities is all of these down here. 16 total possibilities. So the probability that the hobby there all four boys or all four girls is two over 16, which can be reduced to one over eight.